Life is a battle and there's only one choice, win. For some people, they, for the life of them, they cannot think positive. You just can't think positive. Now, the reason you cannot think positive, it is because you come up with too many reasons why it won't work. You look for mistakes, you look for where people could possibly cheat you. It's an extremely difficult or, or negative mind frame. You cannot be happy. Your situation is, your problem is always associated with the later heaven, which is what is going to happen, and early heaven, what has already happened. So you think about it, don't, isn't all your problems associated with something in the past or something in the future? Everything that you're stressed about right now, like, that you're probably frustrated about, concern of bothering you, you're worried, is got something to do with what has already happened or what could happen in the future. Example, a relationship that was bad, you are pissed off, you keep reminding every time you see this person, you feel very unhappy, you feel bad, you, feel you cannot let go. That's something already happened. At this point in time, the present equilibrium, where you are right now, the present, you have no problems. You need to win the internal battle. You need to defeat the person inside who is constantly <coughs> giving you problems. You just think about your own life, now. has it been that easy? or has it been challenges? Every challenge is a battle, right? There are career battles, there are business battles, there are relationship battles. So many things that you have to fight and uh, requires winning. And basically there are three things that, um, that people can obviously do in situations like that. Number one is to get, if there's a problem, you get yourself out of that situation. Number two, you go and fix that situation. Failing which, the third thing you can do is to embrace because that is how you win. And a lot of times, where people can't do the first two, you have to come to embrace. That's where Pazir comes in, right? Okay? So, winning this battle is not so easy, but it's possible. First, you gotta know what are the avenues and weapons that we could use. How do we deal with shit that happens to us? How do we deal with other people that, that, that is around us? So all issues that you have has got something to do with this point of reference. And that only happens at this level. It does happen in the present level. That's why in Chima Dunja, we want to find out what is it that influences from here. If you don't use this tool, this tool will use you. Every day, they insert images and insert feelings and insert pictures for you to see. Where is the origin of a thought? Where does thoughts come from? Who inserted this into your mind? Your thoughts go where after that? They come in, they must go out somewhere, right? We don't know the origin, nor we don't know the destination. This part here, until today, is unexplained. Except if you know Chima Tunja, then you can see what is the source of all this. And with that, by controlling this, we could literally create and walk our reality. That's the difference.